companies are still till this day trying to make their own version of this for their machines. This thing set a uh, high example in quality and what's possible just in general and compact and just what an AMS unit, what a material unit should be like if it's gonna sit on top of the printer. This thing was a game changer. However, there is a lot more of these original AMS units uh, in circulation. Uh, and with these coming out and people switching to these, they're gonna be getting rid of their old AMS units. And let me tell you, these things are no slouch uh, in their own right. And there's a lot of new products coming out there that aim to integrate some of the features here, improve upon them and add them to your original AMS. And I am all about modifying something that you've had for a little while, something older, bringing up the speed, keeping it out of landfill or shipping all over the place, all that. So let's jump right away into the first version of what I'm talking about here, and that's the Sunlu AMS dryer. And what this essentially is, is a powered lid. You open it just like the regular one, put your filament in, but you are getting two powerful fans, two powerful heaters, and a control module for humidity and heat, uh, as well as these uh, large uh, uh, exhaust uh, ports on the back. So the idea of this is you have a standalone heating unit for all of your filament, put whatever you want in there, start it up, vent it so all the heat comes out of it uh, along with all the moisture, it gets sucked out of the filament and you're good to go. It takes the idea that Bamboo Lab he had here to integrate this and kind of turns it to the next level and yet lets you keep your original AMS. 